The medieval town of Rennes is renowned for its architecture, but the beautiful facades can hide an ugly truth, rotting wood panels that often put residents at risk. In the old town, no less than 600 buildings require renovation and 300 others are hazardous, according to a 2008 study. Rennes is made of buildings that look like a chest of drawers, with the drawers being the accommodations. They are often pretty, but sometimes the underlying structure falls apart. You can't really notice it beforehand, and unfortunately that's expensive. The eastern part of the city is a protected site, meaning repairing the buildings has to follow strict codes to preserve their structure. And that doesn't come cheap. It's tough to make co-owners agree to share the bill. In this building, for example, the owner of a studio flat was forced to sell it when he saw the cost would be higher than the value of his apartment. I preferred to give the flat up to the town for free rather than owning it for another two years and being responsible for an empty flat. In some buildings, even recent repairs have to be redone to treat the rotting structure. A facade that becomes waterproof on the outside because of cement, waterproof on the inside because of insulation and plaster, well, for the wood stuck in the middle, all it needs is a little bit of water in the bottom or at the top to make it rot in just a few years. To tackle this decaying grandeur, authorities are now revising some of the rules and regulations. This should allow them to tear down walls that couldn't be touched before. And slowly, they hope, give the medieval center its old charm back.